Yes, I did detransition while still having my king tattoo, and oh, I gotta show you pictures. It was badass. But to be honest, um, when I detransitioned, I kind of looked like an assassin. Um, I'll show you an example, especially when I had short hair, so it kind of fit. So this is me when I detransitioned. And listen, I just love to flex on this. I don't give a shit if I'm a broken record. I was 200 fucking pounds there. Look at me. Look at me. 200 pounds, I look like that. <laughs> And like I said, I'm really only like five, five and a half, five, six, but I got skinny legs, chicken legs, my husband calls them. Listen, you knew I had a Rick Sanchez ass when you met me. What can you do about it? Write to the mayor. Don't write to the mayor because he probably thinks I'm a badass too. Here's me with long hair. My husband always used to call me Morticia, uh, which I love because Morticia's hot as hell, obviously. Um, but yeah, so that's me when I had like, you know, weave in. I had long hair. I still have my kink tattoo. I mean, detransitioned or not, you could still tell I was a little fruity. You know what I mean? I mean... <laughs> I still wear that battle vest till this day. That battle vest was with me pre-transition, uh, during my transition, when I detransitioned, and it's still with me. Chef's kiss. Chef's kiss. Honestly, I am so hot no matter what I do. Yeah, I look like a badass, so I always look like a badass, whether I'm a dude, a chick, no matter what, I look like I might run up on you.